Hey, how's it going? Uh, this, we're gonna talk real quick about the Robinson ISD apps and about rooms for students and parents, okay? So remember, you're gonna need to download the Robinson ISD app. Now there's a previous video uh, that we, uh, there will be linked here towards the end that's gonna kinda give you some information on how to actually get logged in and signed up with Robinson ISD. Uh, rooms and so but remember your email address that's tied inside of Skyward that is how you will log into the rooms application correct otherwise you can't get in if you have an issue with that be sure to email bfuque at robinson.k12.tx.us and he'll get that knocked out for you but it's really simple and really quick and really easy uh, we just need to make sure that we have the correct information for you inside of Skyward so we can get that going all right so let's jump right on into the Robinson ISD application so it's right here on the right. You'll see it says Robinson ISD, not through OShare, but Robinson ISD. So once I click on that, it's going to take me in. And so you'll see here there is our feed for our home and whatever uh, default school that you have inside of there uh, as well. You'll be able to get to that as well. You'll see events. And then in the bottom right corner of the screen, that is where you'll see rooms. So when I click on rooms and I toggle to rooms over here, as you see, it's signing me in. Now, remember, you have to be signed in first for that to work, okay? Uh, if you don't see a class right now for your student, that means that uh, they just haven't, the, the classes haven't been published for that yet. Uh, you'll see them once school starts, if you're already looking at this before school starts, but you'll see uh, the classes. But if you have any students that are in athletics, as you can see, athletics and band has been using this uh, frequently this semester. Uh, and the first thing it does when I click on rooms, it brings up all of uh, the classes for the students. And so we'll jump into high school girls or eighth grade girls athletics. As you can see, when I click on that, there are all the announcements that are in there too, as well, uh, that, that have been going out. All the different posts, if you wanna just see announcements, you can see announcements uh, just right there for that as well. If I wanted to message, this particular coach or this particular teacher with inside of rooms, I can go ahead and do that. When I hit the menu button right next to classes, this allows me to just preview the stream, classwork, and then there's messages. And so what I like about messages is, I can actually come in here and I can click on this and without having to have the email address or, or even having to have the cell phone number of that staff member, I can click on that staff member there and then, or I can do multiple staff members, it's up to you. And when I click the arrow down the bottom right corner, now I'm able to type out a message. If I need to send maybe some information, maybe like a, a picture or, or a camera image and use a camera right then and there or some type of document, I can do that too as well to that uh, teacher or that coach that's in there. Um, and then also if you are, uh, if you have a different translation, and you're typing in uh, using that translation that's set on your phone, it will automatically translate to whatever that recipient's uh, messages is as well. So I'm gonna jump back in here real quick. If I wanna change classes, real simple, click on classes, and then I'll actually take me back to my classes and I can go view those different classes and information that's going on within those classes too as well. If I wanna get back to uh, my menu here, you get back to my stream or a message or even my class info, click on class info. You can see there's all the information that has been put in. Uh, as school gets rolling, you'll see more of that information from teachers too as well uh, that are all in there. So remember, this is an all-in-one application for communication for our district. Guys, and if you have any questions, please email bfuquay at robinson.k12.tx.us and he'll be sure to help you out. Thank y'all very much for, walk, for uh, listening and watching and welcome to Rooms and we look forward to communicating with you soon.